Niacinamide, also called nicotinamide, is a water-soluble form of vitamin B3. It's a powerhouse ingredient because it supports your skin's health at a cellular level. Unlike niacin, which is another form of vitamin B3 and which is generally used orally, niacinamide doesn't cause flushing or redness. It makes it ideal molecule for topical use. It is naturally found in foods like lean meat, fish, nuts, legumes, and yeast. In skincare, we use a synthetic pharmacologically derived version to ensure purity and stability. It can be formulated into serums, moisturizers and these days even into sunscreens. How does it work? It works by boosting NAD plus and NADPH. These two enzymes are critical for energy production, DNA repair and fighting the oxidative stress that happens inside each cell of your skin. So it's like giving your skin a multi-booster energy power boost that will tackle inflammation, pigmentation, acne and aging and all at once. For Indian skin, which often faces challenges like uneven tone and oiliness due to acclimatic conditions, genetics, pollution, I would say niacinamide is a versatile hero. Niacinamide is a multitasker and its benefits are backed by robust evidence and research, making it perfect for Indian skin. How does niacinamide work? Number one, it brightens your skin. We all know Indian skin is rich in melanin and hence it is prone for melasma, pigmentation and post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation which is visible as black spots. Things like acne, mosquito bites, any injury can easily cause a dark spot in an Indian skin. 4% niacinamide with other additives like 2% tranexamic acid reduce the facial dark spots in just 8 weeks. Niacinamide inhibits melanosome transfer which are those packets which contain melanin that travel up from melanocytes in your skin mother layer to the keratinocytes. It lightens the dark skin without causing any irritation, inflammation or itching. Number 2. Niacinamide controls acne. I would say it is a very good add-on to the topical ointments or oral medication prescribed by your dermatologist because this aids or I would say supports the ointments and tablets in reducing sebum production, fighting cutie bacterium acne, the bacteria found in the oil gland and it helps in reducing inflammation and it is ideal for oily and acne prone Indian skin. Number 3. Niacinamide strengthens skin barrier. Yes, Indian skin often faces trans epidermal water loss or loss of moisture to the environment due to difference in the temperature and humidity. Number 4. Anti-aging. Niacinamide boosts collagen production and inhibits glycation. This can help you combat premature aging from sun exposure and pollutants. Number six, antioxidant. We know niacinamide is a turbocharger of the skin and neutralizes free radicals protecting the skin against UV damage and pollution, which are key concerns in India's urban environment. It protects skin cells from oxidative stress, particularly by particulate matter and other pollutants. Skin cancer prevention. Oral 500 mg niacinamide reduce the risk of non-melanoma skin cancer. This is a relevant information, especially for skin types 1, 2 and 3, which is the fair skin type, especially found in Caucasians and West part of the world. This may be of some benefit in people in who are exposed to sun for a long time. Hence, niacinamide may also help you fight the sun exposed or it may mitigate the sun exposed related issues in skin. It definitely will not cause sun sensitivity and hence it is ideal for a warm tropical climate like India. First of all, choose the right product. Opt for serums or moisturizers for 2 to 5% of niacinamide so that to avoid skin irritation. For sensitive Indian skin, you must start with a little less dose to avoid redness. Apply 1 to 2 pumps of a serum. It is a rule in dermatology that you never start a thing overnight. Always use it for a couple of minutes, do a mild patch testing and then go on to use on the full face. Niacinamide can be an additional add-on with your regular serums which contain kojic acid, alpha arbutin. It can be used after using salicylic acid face washes as well but if your skin is dry and sensitive you must avoid this combination. Avoid using high potency niacinamide without consulting your dermatologist because it can cause irritation and it is not routinely advisable to combine these serums 
serums with vitamin C. You can use them thou at different timings of the day. Always use a niacinamide serum with a sunscreen in the morning, which is non-negotiable to prevent any irritation and sensitivity. And niacinamide pairs beautifully with any sunscreen. But if you have very dry skin, you must avoid mineral sunscreens, which contain zinc oxide, because both these ingredients can over dry your skin. How to start? I would always say, I always emphasize to my patients and patrons that start with an alternate day, couple of minutes routine and then build it up slowly to daily use. Visible results take time and you must consult a dermatologist ideally before you try to take up any new molecule, especially if you have sensitive or acne prone skin. Many a times we dermatologists tell you to do a patch test. You must apply a small amount of any drug including niacinamide on your inner forearm or on the back side of your ear. You must wait for 24 hours to see a visible redness or irritation, especially if you have sensitive and dry skin, if you have history of dust allergy, if you have history of seborrheic dermatitis, you have to be extremely careful before starting your journey. Number two, always use a mild non-stripping cleanser in beginning to prep your skin for better better absorption and to avoid dryness and irritation. And as I always say, if you have a skin condition like melasma, eczema, rosacea, self-care, self-medication is not advised. You must consult your dermatologist to ensure that whatever molecule we are using suits your condition. What are the post-care tips if you're using this molecule of niacinamide? Moisturize. You must follow niacinamide with a good moisturizer in the morning to lock in hydration, especially if you have dry skin. You must understand that mild redness or stinging is rare and that happens at concentrations which are found in medical ointments. Over-the-counter niacinamide serums generally do not have the potency as they promise. If this happens, you must reduce your frequency in switch to a lower percentage. Sun protection. Always follow with broad spectrum sunscreen to protect against sun sensitivity and irritation, which is a major concern for Indian skin, especially for Bangalore flu folks because the weather can be really dry. And niacinamide is a very safe molecule that let us enumerate few precautions for Indian skin especially. Number one, please avoid overuse. Excess of anything is bad and a higher concentration may not give us great results but it can cause irritation. You must stick to a lower concentration of 2 to 5% for safety. Number two, watch for flushing. It's very rare that topical niacinamide causes flushing, but oral supplements containing niaci niacin can sometimes irritate the skin. So you must choose a formulation which is high purity. And that is why we dermatologists insist that you must come to us before you embark a journey with the new molecule. Melasma, combining these agents, basically for melasma, a lot of combination creams come with additional things like glycolic acid and tranexamic acid but one must understand that some combinations may actually irritate the skin reduce your skin barrier and worsen your melasma oral supplements high dose oral niacinamide is not recommended for over-the-counter use because more than three grams per day can cause headache or nausea you have to consult a medical doctor before supplementing with oral niacinamide patchy application that is a big no-no when it comes to any skin molecule because uneven application will result in uneven skin tone. You must apply uniformly across the face, but in people who have sensitive face, you should avoid areas like under eyes and very close to mouth because these are the generally dry zones of your face and can get irritated with molecules like niacinamide. Now, the benefits of this molecule are backed by decades of research. 4% niacinamide down-regulated the oxidative stress due to free radicals in skin cells, reducing inflammation and hence problems like acne, inflammation can reduce with niacinamide. 4% niacinamide when N-acetyl glucosamine reduce facial spots by up to 30% in 8 weeks. 2% niacinamide reduce the transepidermal water loss by up to 27% in atopic dermatitis patients, which is very ideal for Indian skin needs. 5% niacinamide helped in preventing aging by 20%. It is not a standalone anti-aging molecule but it does have some anti-aging benefits. Oral niacinamide reduce non-melanoma skin cancer risk by up to 30% in high-risk patients
conditions especially relevant for western and caucasian skin in indian skin especially we are called as fitzpatrick type 3 and 5 because we are prone for pigmentation oiliness and sensitivity one is the weather other is the harsh pollution and the changing climate so ability of a molecule to regulate sebum reduce melanin transfer and strengthen the skin barrier at the same time makes it a perfect fit for us it's anti inflammatory properties this soothe irritation from pollution or heat antioxidant effects protect against uv damage it's gentle enough for sensitive skin whether you're in mumbai's humid weather delhi's polluted weather bangalore's dry weather niacinamide adapts to your needs but please consult your dermatologist before embarking your journey with this wonderful niacinamide so niacinamide is our go all molecule combined with the good moisturizer and sunscreen next day it can be a good additional useful molecule in your daily routine you will most of the pharmacologically derived niacinamide are better formulated with more purity than mostly the ones which are found in over the counter products and i hope you liked our session uh, with niacinamide where we have tried to describe the past present and future of this molecule if you want us to talk about any molecule in detail please feel free to write in the comment section or you can email us at info@drdivyasharma.com we would be very happy to give you science backed information about all your skin and hair care needs